Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, it's me, Dr. Donna. Welcome to week four of 10. Last week, I read Million Dollar Consulting. Here's what I have for you. Ladies and gentlemen, this was the first edition of this book. I moved my books from my office downstairs to our family room that has been converted into a library. And I thought I had read all of my books that I had previously purchased. And I had a colleague come visit me from Michigan. We were looking at my books and I realized I hadn't read this book. I thought, oh my goodness, this was even before the book challenge because now when I read a book, I put the week, the day that I read it, the week that I read it. And then I also have whether I recommended it or not. So I had to read the first edition of this book. I am recommending the book, but I'm also saying get the most recent edition of the book. Because it was written in the early 90s, there are some things that are no longer appropriate or useful because it's email marketing, it's mailing and things like that, and everything is digital now. But other than that, this was a great book. I have several points that resonated with me, but the one point that resonated the most with me was to set up your own playing field and make your own rules. And when you do that, you don't have any competition because there are so many consultants out there now, you have to do something different. You have to dip make, you have to risk take. And in order to do that, you set the playing field, you set the rules, and now people will come to you for your unique offering because you are the only person in the entire world that can do that. So that is my biggest takeaway. Here are some other nuggets for you. Last week, I started a next cycle. At the end of every last one of my social media posts, I started adding my website address. Before, I was just letting it fade out to black, to green, to blue, to purple, whatever matched the particular piece of content. And last week, I started adding it to every last post. It was a great next cycle. It has taken just a little bit longer to add it, but I think it completes every single post. And now there is a call to action after every single post. Go visit the website. It is a great next cycle, and I'm happy that I started doing it. This week's book, Poke the Box. Well, that's my time, ladies and gentlemen. But before I get out of here, just remember the tenacity of 10. Let the next cycle begin. Adios.